Welcome to the most political World Cup. The 1934 World Cup was an all-out effort by Benito Mussolini to promote fascism. Many countries did not participate in these competitions for political reasons or sent their second team to the competitions. Uruguay, the previous champion and British Empire boycotted the tournament. And Argentina, the finalist of the previous round, did not send even one of the players of the 1930 World Cup to the tournament because they were not sure of the safety of their players' lives in fascist Italy. This was the first World Cup in which qualifiers were held. Twelve quotas for the European continent, three quotas for the American continent, and one quota for the African or Asian continent were considered. Finally, Austria, Belgium, Czechoslovakia, France, Germany, Hungary, Italy, Netherlands, Romania, Spain, Sweden, and Switzerland from Europe, Argentina, Brazil, and United States from America and Egypt as the first African country made it to the 1930 World Cup. The matches were held as knockouts, and in case of a tie in 90 minutes, the game went to overtime of 30 minutes, and in case of a tie in overtime, the game was repeated the next day. Due to the importance of the promotional aspect of the competitions for the fascist government, about 3.5 million liras were spent on holding the competition. The first round games were held in eight different cities simultaneously on May 27, 1934. The famous San Siro Stadium in Milan was one of the stadiums of the 1934 World Cup. The game ball was called Federal 120, which was produced in Italy. In the first round, all non-European teams were eliminated. It is the only all-European quarter-final in World Cup history. Austria, Czechoslovakia, Germany, Hungary, Italy, Spain, Sweden, and Switzerland were the teams that advanced from this stage. The game between Spain and Italy was the most exciting and sensitive game of the second round. This was the first game of the World Cup that was repeated. The first leg was tied 1-1 and was so physical that Spanish goalkeeper Ricardo Zamora and Italian player Mario Piziolo missed the replay. The replay was not much different from the first game and at least three Spanish players left the field due to injuries. In the end, Italy won 1-0 and reached the semi-finals. On June 3, 1934, two semi-final games started simultaneously. The torrential rain in the match between Austria and Italy made the game difficult for the Austrians' tactics, which were based on ground passes. Italy took advantage and qualified for the final with a narrow goal victory. The game between Czechoslovakia and Germany was a battle between technique and physics, which finally ended with the victory of the Czechoslovak technique. Czechoslovak striker Aldrich Najedli scored a hat-trick in this game. The final game was held on June 10, 1993, at the Stadio Nazionale PNF in Rome. In the 71st minute, Czechoslovakia scored the first goal of the game. But this advantage lasted only 10 minutes and Italian striker Orsi tied the game. The game went to extra time and in the 95th minute, Italy scored the winning goal and the goal of its first championship in the World Cup. The second World Cup was watched by 363,000 people closely and a total of 70 goals were scored in 17 games played. The top scorer of the games was Czechoslovak striker Aldrich Najedli with five goals. The best offensive line and the best defensive line both belonged to Italy. They scored 12 goals and conceded three goals in this cup. There are many rumors in this Italian championship. The interferences of the Italian fascist government and the Italian dictator at that time, Benito Mussolini, were many in organizing the competitions. For example, Mussolini used to choose the referees of Italian games himself. Also, over the years, many reports about the bribery and corruption of this World Cup have reached FIFA. However, the Italian team's values cannot be questioned. Two years later, they also became champions in the 1936 Olympics held in Germany, and in 1938 in the French World Cup. Well, I don't want to say. Subscribe to the Final Matches channel, I will explain it to you in the next video.